everyone, hope you're feeling okay. So today I have a very special guest with me and it's my sister Hayley. Hi. And um, we've also got family cat Louie here as well to say hello. Um, but I'm home for the weekend so I thought it might be fun to film a couple of videos with my sister Hayley. Mm -hmm. And we thought that today we would do a makeup video but a makeup video of a twist because usually I do the makeup on Hayley. Yeah. But we were like, why doesn't Hayley do the makeup on me? What we thought we'd do is, is Hayley wears a lot less makeup than me, she also doesn't fake tan like I do. No. So we thought that we would do Hayley's everyday makeup routine on me. We just thought it'd be something fun, quite fun to do because I feel that as I'm getting older I realise that I'm getting more confident within myself. So I feel that I don't need to wear as much makeup and fake tan as what yeah, I did when I was younger. Because I feel more confident, I feel that they don't make me confident. If that makes sense, I feel that kind of myself yeah so I thought that it might be quite fun to try something a little bit different with my makeup and maybe it will branch me to think yeah. about other things like maybe like ditching the fake tan and stuff exactly so yeah we thought that we'd try something a bit different so I'm gonna go take my makeup off now and then I'm gonna let myself be in the safe hands <laughs> or should Not I say safe, safe. <laughs> um, hands of my sister and yeah we just thought it'd be a fun video to do so yeah I need to get the makeup wipes uh -oh. and then we'll get started <laughs> So my foundation, as I've been raving a lot in the past few videos, is the Bordeaux Healthy Mix. But at the moment this is a little bit too dark for my skin. So what we're going to do is we're going to mix it with one of Hayley's paler foundations, which Hayley suggested, um, to kind of make it a little bit more natural, more like my skin tone. Yeah. So Hayley's is going to do that now. <laughs> It's usually me who does your makeup, isn't it, Hills? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Never been the other way around. Not since we're little. It's a good practice. What for? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so you, what's your favourite foundation for like pale skin? Um, I think my favourite is YSL Touch of Class. Oh, I love that one. Mm, I think because it has such a broad range of shades. Yeah. It's really good. Can you find one that's pale enough for you? Yeah. Yeah. B10. <laughs> I like it. I think mine, the one that I have is like B15. Yeah. So yeah, a bit of a, a difference. That one. So as you can see, Hayley's just done my foundation and I've just had a little look around. I think it looks really nice and like fresh. Almost. Fresh taste. Fresh faced. <laughs> um, so yeah, I guess it's, what do you think next? What do you go next? Concealer. Concealer? Right, yeah. concealer time it is. Okay, so we're going on to concealer, and you've actually got the same concealer as me, haven't you? Yeah. <laughs> so you really like the amazing concealer, don't you? I love this. I put it in my April favourites. Yeah, I love it that much. <laughs> right, so we're just going to start with a little bit of that. Yeah. This is really like high coverage, so if you are feeling a little bit self-confident because you might not have the most amazing skin, this is a really, really good concealer because a little goes a really long way, yeah, and it exactly. looks so natural as well. So, because the thing is, like, it is hard when you get spots and stuff. Because we've both had like spots in the past, haven't yeah, we? Like, I, I still suffer with them. Teenage skin. But yeah, it's just a nightmare. And, like, you, sometimes you just don't feel very confident going bare faced. No, definitely. Okay, so we've done concealer. So what's next? Blusher. Blusher. We're skipping the powder and bronzer, oh. which is actually, I usually do my next two steps, a powder, bronzer and contour. So I'm skipping out three, <laughs> skipping out three steps. Mm -hmm. You don't ever do them? Nope. No. No. <laughs> but yeah, what blush are you using today? We're using the Benefit Major Act. I love, it's such a lovely peachy, kind of yeah. natural shade. You tend to go for like pinky. Yeah. Do you say they're kind of best for like pale skin tones? Yeah, I think they're for my skin tones. So it's slightly well, I kind of suit more kind of warm toned products like peaches, oranges, yeah. corals. Whilst you're cool toned. Yeah. So you like pink and like kind of blue toned. Yeah, definitely. Okay, so now we, what's next? We've done blusher. Um, then eyes. Eyes, so we're skipping out highlighter. Yeah. You don't highlight? No. All natural. <laughs> you just have a natural glow. Yep. This is like my favourite part. This is definitely going to be interesting. It is. Okay, so what are we doing for eyes? What do you use? Um, I use my Naked Palette Wash. Oh, which bought you bought that. I bought you that for Christmas. Is it last year or the year before? Year my before, birthday, I think. It's your birthday? Yeah, seventeenth before Christmas. Mm. Um, so yeah. Now obviously, every day, as you see in my videos, I always go for quite a dramatic smoky eye. Like, 
that is yeah. just my everyday kind of go-to makeup. Well, mm -hmm. no. that that's not for you, is no. it? No. <laughs> what kind of ID like what you go for like today? Um, just a bit like natural, but a little bit of a hint of glow. Okay, Something like that. Quite nice. shimmery. Yeah. Okay. A little right. bit sparkle wouldn't never hurt anyone. Why did you never feel the need to fake tan? I don't know. I just guess, didn't. I guess I kind of want to be different. Yeah. I think we always like to be a bit different. Yeah. When we've grown up. So yeah. Cool. I want to go opposite. <laughs> and you don't ever feel the need to like fake tan or anything? No. That's really good. I think it is more almost trendy yeah. to be pale. Yeah. It's like if you look at like in. models and celebrities, it's all about yeah pale skin, isn't it? Rather yeah, than like tanned. Yeah. Again, I think tan kind of going out. Trend. Definitely. Pale and interesting. Definitely, because it is like, I only self tan because it's the safest way to tan. Yeah. Like, I don't like really sunbathing. No. Like, when I was younger, I was an idiot, as you know, <laughs> because I, I went on sunbed, which is really, really stupid, and mm -hmm. I could, if I could rewind time, I wouldn't have gone on that. No. And I used to be a bit silly in the sun, but now that I've got older, I know how important it is yeah, to look after your skin and you are you, you've always like whenever we go on holiday Hayley is so cautious <laughs> about looking after her skin yep like you always have like really really high sun protection yep you're always covering up mm -hmm. and you're always in the shade like between <laughs> like in the afternoon Hayley's just in the shade reading her book yep like I always remember that and I'd be like oh <laughs> but I feel that I am kind of becoming more conscious that I am yeah but I kind of want to get out of that mindset of feeling that I need to fake tan yeah to you, feel good you because to. you don't you don't have to no, at all no. like you don't have to be tanned no to be like I don't know what's the right word like gorgeous do you know yeah. what I mean to feel it, you yeah because there are like you know it is changing like we said more models and celebrities are pale mm. which is kind of making it cooler isn't it yeah I think about like fairy tales and things like that they're all pale that's true, like, we're watching Once Upon a Time at the moment on Netflix, and all the princesses are all pale, pale. aren't they? Yeah. Like Snow White, yep. people like that, they're mm. all super, super pale. So when when you go in the sun, mm -hmm. do you, so you know we're coming up to summer, do you wear SPF under your makeup? Yeah, yeah. definitely. Always get a really high SPF. Because I, I never knew this till the other day, you can't just rely on foundation, the yeah. SPF in your foundation. I always thought you could, but you can't, you have to put an SPF. Yeah, under the fans are always good too. Always put it on because yeah. there's nothing worse than a wrinkly face, is there? <laughs> no, there's not. No. So now we're just using a bit of the dark horse just to kind of define instead of eyeliner. Because you don't you don't use eyeliner, do you? No, I always other. use liquid eyeliner, so this will be quite interesting. Okay, so we have done the eyeshadow. Mm -hmm. And now it's time for mascara. Oh, yeah. So today we're using the Benefit They're Real. Hmm. I started using this again recently. It's good. Yeah, it's good. Benefit do well with Do you want mascara. me to do my mascara? Would that make things easier? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> it's always tricky. How many coats do you do? And I'll do however much. Just one. Just one. Okay. <laughs> you don't curl your lashes? Nope. Okay. That's what we'll do then. <laughs> okay, so what's next? Uh, brows. Brows, yep. So just a little bit. So we're using the Makeup Revolution. Your brows are quite natural, aren't they? You don't tend to go don't get too defined. No. Me and Hayley have quite naturally quite thick brows, don't we? Yeah. We were born with the family <laughs> <laughs> thick brow. I'm quite glad it's become a trend. <laughs> yeah, definitely. But that's the thing, like, when we were growing up, stuff like really thin eyebrows was the trend. Yeah. And it made you feel like if you had anything like thick brows, yeah. it made you feel really awful, didn't it? Yeah, definitely. And like the same of like when I was growing up, it was all about fake tanning, mm. which I guess is maybe why I'm like the way that I am. But it's really cool to see that stuff changing. Yeah, definitely. So that you don't feel like you have to. <laughs> okay, so I we've done brows, haven't we? Yep. And now it's time for lips. Okay, so what do you want me to do lip wise? Just a little bit of lipstick, a little bit of lip gloss, maybe. Okay, I obviously usually line my lips with lip liner. <laughs> I slightly overline them, mm. and then I put lipstick on. Yeah, so you just go straight in, straight in. So what we use them today? We use a Mac patisserie, which is one. Is that favorites. what you've got on right now? Yeah. It's a really nice natural like. I hate this phrase, your lips look better. better. Yeah. It's such a horrible <laughs> phrase, but it's so, so true, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, definitely. No, this one's really pretty. Yeah, it's a lovely shade, isn't it? It's right now, though. Oh, I need to get a new one. Okay, it's not too much. It is actually a really pretty 
colour of shade, isn't it? And is that... Are we done? Is that everything? Yeah. When you do your makeup? Yeah. Okay, so this is the kind of steps that Hayley does every single day of her everyday makeup. Yep. So we're done? Yeah, we're okay, done. Okay, so let's have a mm -hmm. look, because I'm sure it'll be different to like my normal makeup. God, the eye, my eyes look really, really like fair for me. <laughs> but um, I quite like it though. Like, I think looking at my face, even though we've skipped bronzer and highlighter mm -hmm. and not put too much blush on, I don't actually think you can... It's not much different. You can't it's tell. Nice. It does, I think my face looks very like fresh and quite natural yeah. and quite glowy. Yeah, definitely. You've got a natural glow. Mm. But no, I actually quite like it. I think, yeah, my face looks really quite, you know, natural. I like the lip colour. That's an amazing lip colour, isn't it? Lip colour. And yeah, the eyes. The little bit on the lash line actually kind of adds a little bit of Does. smokiness. Yeah. Without being over the top. Over the top. Yeah. But no, I like the brows. I actually really like it. I wasn't sure whether I was because obviously we're we've skipped out a few steps that I do all the time. Yeah. But I don't think, I don't really think I need bronzer. No, see? Or anything like <laughs> that. Change. Change, which means I'd actually save time in my makeup. Exactly. Routine, which is good. A bit longer in bed. Yeah, that's always, that's always a good thing. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, Hayley's done my makeup now yeah. and I actually feel that I may actually change some of my makeup habits Ooh. now <laughs> because it has made me realise that I don't actually always have to wear. Yeah loads of bronzer and maybe this could be a step to like almost ditching the fake tan yep, as well so that's quite cool so yes yeah, so i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you enjoyed seeing a little bit of my sister and seeing <laughs> something a little bit different i thought it just me might be quite a fun mm -hmm. thing to film yeah. and like show you a different kind of makeup look because obviously when i do my videos i do very similar makeup yeah. looks very bronzy very smoky so i thought it might be cool to see something a little bit different so make sure you give the video a thumbs up and subscribe <laughs> and yeah i put all the links down below down below, down that, below. I've <laughs> <laughs> that i've mentioned but yeah thanks very much for watching and i'll see you very soon bye, bye.